today I want to talk about how we can simplify Christmas decorations. We are getting close to December. Christmas music is being played on the radio. It snowed a couple times where we are. Now I'm somebody who loves to decorate for Christmas in November and uh, some people might think that's early. Other people love to do it as well. My kids and I, we did our decorating just the other weekend and it was a great time to reevaluate the decorations that we use and making sure that the decorations that we have are ones that we still want to be putting out that we still really enjoy and the ones that we really haven't been using it's a good time for us to be donating those so i'd say the first thing you want to just take a look at what you have and really take note of whether you used all of your decorations last year double check that whatever you have in your bin if you have things that you aren't putting out or you know that you didn't put out last year then you need to really think okay why am i storing these in a bin if i'm not going to be using them pass them along donate them so someone else can get value out of them so we got these stockings last year and prior to that we had been using these so this is a really good example of um we don't need to be holding on to these anymore because these are the ones that we're going to be using. So this is definitely one thing that we can donate this year. Depending on the age of your kids, it's also a good time for you to reevaluate whether some of the decorations you have are still appropriate and whether they will want to be using them. We currently have two nativity sets. We have one that is definitely for younger kids. It is the little people style one, and it's really cute, plays music. We got it after my sister's kids were older and beyond playing with it. And so our kids have loved this nativity set. We have another one that's more kind of a display one that's a little nicer, but our kids do still play with that one. However, I do see that the little people one having a life span in our home. So I see maybe in the next year or so us probably regifting that, passing along, donating it to another family. One other thing we found in our Christmas bin from the past couple years are just these are little little toys. I think they actually were bath toys that we just used uh, as like Christmas play toys with the kids. So it's like a Rudolph, a Christmas tree, a Santa, Frosty and some presents. And so our kids have played with them a lot in the past. So this is something I'm gonna just check in with my kids to see if they are still interested in playing with these. Otherwise, uh, this would be something that we would donate. So what are your thoughts? Are these, are these toys that you would still be interested in playing with mm -hmm. this year? Yeah. So should we still keep them? and wait to donate them for another year? What do you think? Wait to donate them for another year. Okay, it is good to still ask your kids and um, if they do still wanna keep them, then really think, really pay attention to whether this year, if they do play with them, because if they say they want to keep them, but they don't play with them at all, that will be your, your answer that, you know what, this was last year for them. And then after Christmas, you can be donating them. I wish if we had Santa's sleigh attached with reindeer. Yeah. But this could attach to it. We can maybe make one out of Lego. We could. Maybe. We could try. Mm. <laughs> okay, so these are keep for this year? Mm -hmm. Alright, thank you. Alright, you can go back to playing with the manger.